Dá não? Bariátrica. Bariátrica. Azar vai dando. Pretty good. Just out here trying to see what this noise is and uh, listen. Bullfrogs. That's what it is. I don't know if y'all can hear them on the camera or not, but I have bullfrogs sitting over the hill there at that pond. Uh, it would take a half track and a pretty good sized bulldozer to get down there right now because you can see it's pretty growed up, but I don't plan on going down there. It's about 94 degrees right now. We've been in a massive heat wave. And, uh, man, I'm telling you, it's been rough. It ain't been easy. And uh, I've had a little tubers blocked, and uh, that, and the heat, and the work, and you, you stack everything on together and make a big sandwich out of it. And uh, that's why I ain't been on here, which not making excuses. Because there is no excuse, but anyway. Uh, took my daughter down there the other day to her first auction. And, uh, she was sitting there, and that auctioneer got up there, and they had all kinds of stuff. Now, I went, when I went down there, I was very monetarily unprepared. And, uh, because I thought, well, i just go in, you know, and I'll let her listen to the auctioneer for an hour or so, and we'll come to the house. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, when we get up there in that auctioneer, he puts it in high gear, and he starts selling all this massive big table of stuff. And about three-fourths of it I wanted. Well, I didn't win anything. Because I couldn't bid over 15 bucks because, you know, that and uh, that and I run up on a, a chili dog sale that they was having down there. And I, and I said, I want one of them chili dogs there and I'm going to try it. I have to try a chili dog. To me, to me a chili dog, it will dictate how things is going to be at the place that you're at. Okay? But that's just me. So anyway... That's just like a fair. You can't beat a chili dog at the fair. Uh, different places, you know, you gotta, gotta try the chili dog. But anyway, I went up and up and I said, try one of your chili dogs there. You know, well, my daughter, she got, I think it was peach or cherry cobbler, I believe it was. And then, uh, man, they have to, uh, listen. I took a bite of that chili dog and I said, it's gonna be a good auction. And uh, I knew it right away. But anyway, that auctioneer started, and he's selling this stuff. Now, this was funny because, you know, if you've ever been to a good old country auction, you know how the auctioneer talks and, you know, goes on about stuff. Anyway, he's bidding on something. Anyway, I run it up to about $8. This old whatnot or something. And uh, anyway, I told him now, you know, I cut my bid off. And he said, you done? Yep. And he sold it to this guy. I think it was $9 what he got it for and he said he said you done i said yep he said sold to this guy right here for a nine dollar bill my daughter looked at me and she said a nine dollar bill they make them i said no no i said he's gonna say two dollar bill three dollar bill four dollar bill five dollar bill he's gonna say it all the way up to about fifteen dollars okay so don't be surprised if you hear him say eleven dollar bill because that's just auction slang i mean that's the way it's out you know and uh, we really had a good time with it, though. Uh, man. But anyway, I ain't really been into a whole lot. And, but, I, you know, I got to apologize again because I, I don't have any excuse for not coming out here and making these videos. And uh, whether it's hot or not, who cares? You know what I'm saying? I got to go out here and start making more videos. And, uh, but, and, uh, but I tell you, it's supposed to cool down. I think it's supposed to actually start raining sometime. Sometimes tonight, I can't wait. Oh, man. Uh, I need rain so bad. I got cucumbers, son. I'm telling you what. I could have swore one of them come up out of the ground and walked over to my water hose the other day. But now, I don't think it did, but it could have. But they start doing that, I'm moving out of here. But anyway. Uh, we've been hearing, uh, hearing some things in the woods down in here. Give you a little update on that. My Sasquatch update. And i uh, been hearing... Been hearing a lot of that kind of stuff around here. I ain't seeing anything. But I thought I'd just come out here and throw a video together. I done one earlier this morning before it got too hot, and then I took it back to the house, and I realized that I didn't have my microphone turned on again. So I mimed about an eight-minute video. But I don't know. I thought my bunny would come out. I got a wild rabbit down here, and it'll come out in the road, and it'll stand and watch you until you run right over top of it. Whether you're walking, driving, it don't matter. 
I walked by it the other day. I was walking up to the, I was walking up the top of the hill there, and it was sitting there in the path. I actually had to walk around it, and I said, "Boy, you getting awful brave." So uh, I named it Biscuit. But anyway, I'm gonna start feeding it. I'm gonna start seeing if I can feed it and bait it in, make it tame, because it's uh, it ain't bothering either. Well. It did eat one of my wife's cucumbers the other day, hanging off the side of the fence there. We got them growing up the side of a fence, and it was just going to town on it. And she said, that thing ate my cucumber. Yeah. And so, but anyway, it is what it is. Uh, but I'm going to get up off here, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it a weekend, get ready to go back to work tomorrow, and uh, see what kind of adventure I can have this week down there. But it's an adventure every day. But, oh well. I guess we just got to do the best we can do with what we got, right? It's Buddy Isaac. Everybody take care. And I'm out. And I throwed my shoulder out. Man, not really. <laughs>